this day. When I fill out the self-identification portion of any official forms, I get frustrated with the term Caucasian. <clears throat> Caucasian, adjective, commonly used to describe people characterized by white skin, particularly those of European origin. This term was coined by German anthropologist Johann Blumenbach, since the Caucasus Mountains are the homeland for most of the white races. Really? We're going to let a German define race for all of Europe? That is stupid. And I ain't having it. Because truth be told, some of my people are Wops from southern Italy, some of my people are Polacks from the middle of Poland. A couple limeys and a frog work their way into the lineage a long way, so my background is a whole lot broader than the Caucasus Mountains, thank you very much. Caucasian. Generic. I do not approve. In fact, I propose that we change the terminology. I mean, my people are from here and here and here. So if all these folks from all these parts can be named for some random geographical feature all the way over here, well then why couldn't it be the Black Sea? They're right next to each other. <laughs> Caucasus Mountains, drop the mountains, Caucasian. Black Sea, drop the sea, black. Simple mathematics. <laughs> oh, no, I'm not really suggesting that whites should be called blacks. That ain't right either. But if the logic is that all these people from all these places are supposedly descended from the same small group of people here and are so-called Caucasians, well then, why are all these people from all these places called Africans since humankind is supposedly descended from the same small group of people there? <laughs> These are the kinds of things that went through my mind at the age of 15. I mean, it was bad enough as a six-year-old boy feeling like I had to choose between my mother's Polish heritage and my father's Italian heritage, that my mother had to go and throw this African influence up in the mix, and well, we all know now that nurture beats nature, right? So for all those reasons and more, I felt black, and I wanted to be black, or at least I didn't want to be white, or I didn't want to be a color at all. Because identity is more complicated than color, right? I mean, I knew that even before my white mother married my black dad. But when people ask me, what are you? I didn't know what to say. Identity crisis. Dang, Jimmy, why you always trying to act black and stuff? <laughs> I ain't trying to act black. I'm just trying to be me. Yeah, that's right, me. And you don't know me. You don't even know me. Shoo. <laughs> 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 okay, fine, maybe I was acting black. But I didn't have to try, it just came naturally. I mean, not to disrespect my European-American culture, but come on. Hockey, heavy metal, mullets. Who? Hip-hop, high-top fades. <laughs> and this is the 80s we're talking about, so. Oh, 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 be black, baby, be black.